City machinery and a team of National Guardsmen rolled into Beaver Falls this week with one task in mind, demolish abandoned homes. Megan Schiller caught up with the city manager about how this idea became a reality. From this to that. The National Guard is knocking down nearly a half dozen homes. It's part of a big plan to spruce up the neighborhood and reduce crime. It's demo day in Beaver Falls. This week we'll do four total. Actually, it's demo week. It's a good idea. It helps prevent drug use. The city wants to rid itself of abandoned homes that just don't look nice. Everyone's really excited about the fact that they're getting uh, blighted properties taken down next to them because it increases their value of their home. And it's all happening thanks to engineers with the Pennsylvania National Guard. We do an uh, on-call basis and then everything's based on funding too. So if we have the funding and someone gives us a call, we can do it for them. City manager Charlie Jones saw the idea watching TV in Ohio. Thought it would be uh, kind of an interesting thing to do to bring back here in Beaver Falls. And so I started some research and, and got in touch with the National Guard. After filling out the right paperwork, a team of 11 engineers brought out the claw and the dumpsters. It's five houses for now, but it's a start. Oh, we got over hundreds, yeah, at least two or three hundred homes here in Beaver Falls. We've torn down like 10 or 11 in the last two or three years. And they're chipping away at that number in hopes to reduce crime and drug use. First of all, it's unsightly and it attracts uh, negative activity, and so that's why it's a priority for us to get these type of properties down. And plus, it helps to revitalize that area and hopefully. Uh, we could bring someone and want to build on that site. And in terms of the money for the project, the National Guard is paying for all of the demolition. The only thing the Beaver Falls has to pay for is the removal of those dumpsters filled with debris. Reporting in Beaver Falls, I'm Megan Schiller, KDKA TV News.